Okay, so let me know when you're rolling. Okay, rolling. You're rolling. <laughs> okay, great. All right, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Today in part two, we're talking about the process. At the end of last week's video, we mentioned that every birth search process is unique. So you might be wondering, how are we gonna cover the search process for all adoptees? And for a while, we were wondering the same thing. In reality, there's just no way we can cover all the birth search possibilities in one video, but we can cover some concrete pieces of the birth search process. Here at Holt, we've walked alongside many adoptees as they navigate birth search, and we're happy to provide additional support and caring as you move through the process. Regardless of the role your adoptive parents play, the process inherently affects family dynamics, whether you expect it to or not. Which is why it's important to have a good support system to help manage these changes. With that being said, our closest friends and family probably don't have a lot of experience supporting someone through a birth search. Which is why it's important to supplement those primary supports with professionals. The next step in the process is to contact your adoption agency to obtain a copy of your file and see if they help with search. Knowing the search programs offered by your agency can help you gauge what your next step should be. Just like any relationship, our feelings about our adoption agency might be complicated. It's common to feel everything from resentment to gratitude to ambivalence towards your adoption agency. Obtaining your file and having information about your history is critical for self-growth and serves as a solid foundation for search with or without your agency. Having a file that documents how you entered your family is something that's unique to adoptees. We never hear our non-adoptee friends talking about their file, unless they mean this file, or this file, or these files. Did you find the files? I don't even know what they look, what do they look like? Simply seeing your adoption file can bring up lots of emotions in and of itself, even if there's no new information. So be prepared to take advantage of your support systems as you thumb through the pages of life before adoption. The reality of some of our stories is that not everyone, by no fault of their own, has enough information to locate birth family. If there is enough information, your agency will begin working with your sending country to begin search. What this looks like exactly really varies between sending countries and depends on the infrastructure that's been developed to assist adoptees in search. For some countries, this means sending physical letters out to old addresses to locate parents. For others, it means that social workers try and visit areas where they know parents used to live or it could mean publishing a news article or missing persons post online. Keep in mind that the outcomes of search are never guaranteed, and the time that you can spend waiting really varies. On top of searching through the adoption agency, to hedge their bets, many adoptees will simultaneously search through third-party organizations, DNA testing, and private investigators. You're free to choose whichever search option you're most comfortable with, and all of these options provide potential advantages and disadvantages. Regardless of how you choose to search, here at Holt, we are committed to serving adoptees. We do this by engaging in conversations one-on-one -on -one with adoptees, directing them to helpful resources, and in many cases, facilitating the search process. There will be a lot of questions, like a lot of questions. And these questions are magnified by the fact that we'll spend a lot of time waiting for answers that might not come. When it comes to search, there are a lot of obstacles and no guaranteed outcomes. We'll be talking more about possible outcomes in part three of this series. We cannot emphasize enough the importance of having support during this process and the fact that every search process is going to be different. But we hope that these general steps will give you a better picture of what search will look like for you. And cut. All right. Yeah. <laughs>